to see. I think that it's right up here. I think this is the place. Okay, let's go inside. What's your name? Big Mike. Big Mike. Great. When I first started working here in 1989 at the Brass Rail, this was the drag bar. My first gay bar experience was a place called The Apartment. You could go from the hut on University Avenue and down to Shadows, over to the hole. San Diego in the 70s. Enough Donna Summers to just make a gag. You know, we were outlaws. We didn't know what was coming down the pike. In the early 1980s, AIDS did equal death. Am I going to die from this? It made us angry because we're going to get the government to pay attention. There was nobody standing up for us. So we started raising money. And the only place to do so was in the bars. The gay bars were always there for helping. Taking care of people, taking care of friends. Gay bars are a home for gay people. You are not the only one. This is where our world revolved. We didn't have anybody else. The bars not only built our civil rights movement and struggle, it also built our community of family.